What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. It is time for possibly the last Grixis cube draft. Uh, I have enjoyed this cube. The problem I have with the impossible foods coming to the fast food market is that I don't think the restaurants that are going there are good. Yeah, well, that's not really a problem, though. I mean, it's the same as just not eating them, right? Like, if you weren't eating them before, you're not eating them now. Uh, I like Grave Titan. I like Urza. I like Dak Faden. Those are the picks that are standing out to me. Tomorrow, we will be starting the modern queue we also have a bunch of modern decks on queue uh, in the queue on modern decks on deck <clears throat> modern decks on deck modern decks on dax duplicate okay we just beat that to the ground i think it's just grave titan this isn't really a deck actually maybe it is a deck fade in format i don't know man I've done a ton of drafts in this in this cube, and it's still kind of a mystery to me. I mean, the Whopper, the the Impossible Whopper is pretty delicious. I think Grave Titan's better than Reanimate. I think by its uh, Telerian Academy is, mm, uh, 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 Impossible Whopper is good, but very likely not a Whopper is scary, and even probably a Whopper is suspicious. Wow. <sighs> Telerian Academy. Or we can take Hostage Taker. Hostage Taker, Telerian Academy. Hostage Taker, Telerian Academy. Telerian Taker, Hostage Academy. Thirteen seconds. I think the upside on Solarian Academy is way, way higher. Way, way higher. I'm gonna take Everflowing Chalice here. Uh, I like Eldest Reborn a lot. All right, we're gonna Academy, guys. I guess we're gonna put you in the deck at least. Yeah, I mean, there's always going to be a 3 to $4 upcharge for impossible food right now just because it's a lot more costly than beef. It's just the way it is. That being said, I'll pay it. Minding my business. It's just a pocrocyte. This pack isn't very exciting. I like Steel Hellcat a lot, actually. I think it's actually a good card. You know what? I'm going to take a Steel Hellkite. And if we can get a Metal Worker, then we're talking. Then we're in business. If you steal all your burgers like a real gentleman, they cost the exact same. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, Talisman of Dominance. Probably better than Treasure Map. Yeah, I think we can Talisman here. Chromatic Lantern, huh? I recommend a little pea jack on a burger. Paper Jack's a great burger cheese. I like Chromatic Lantern. You like Chrome Box over Chromatic Lantern? I think Shell Doc Isles even got a good uh, a good chance here. Mind's Desire. Great burger cheese and an even better meatball sub cheese. Disgusting. What's up, Dan Omek? Academy actually could be great if we do get uh, Mind Slaver. 
I like Hangerback Walker too. I love that on your I I love that that you're on YouTube, but I really miss being able to interact. Hey, buddy, I'll interact with you right here. Dang it! Is it just Lotus Petal here? We just play the Lotus Petal to to buff the Academy. Wham! Bam! Alakazam! Uh, I don't like Rock because we have no red right now other than Chromatic Lantern. Wow, Urza? Alright, that's pretty good. Jeez. That feels pretty nice. Alright, maybe we're just more of a mono blue artifact deck than the previous iteration of our mono blue artifact. I can get down on A1 and a burger. My go to if I get lettuce, pickles, fresh, fresh onions, A1, and cheese. That thing sounds good. Maybe I'll just get burgers tonight. That sounds great. It didn't until you guys kept talking about them. Oh, the hostage here came back. Draconis, what's going on? Um, I don't think this is a really a defense grid cube. I think we're taking the hostage taker because we can steal artifacts with it. You want me to send you an impossible offer? I mean... <laughs> oh, Kerwit. My god. The funny thing is I know I just know you're not kidding, which is why it's so funny. Ah, uh, I like a forbid. Future sight's good, but let's just forbid. Put the grave site over here for now, I'm not sure. Oh my god. To the slaughter. It's probably better than Delver here. That's it, you're getting a whopper. Oh dear god. Drawn from dreams? Oh, yes. I stand future sight? What does that even mean? I don't even know what the word stand in that sentence means. Oh, wow. Jace? Yeah, I'll take a Jace. Hold me closer, Stratus Dancer. Count the headlights on the highway. I don't think I've seen Glenlange Archmage in this cube yet, so I'm actually pretty tempted to take that. Standing something is being a huge fan of it. That doesn't... Oh, dear. Since when? <laughs> How long has that been a thing? That sounds just ridiculous. Thought Vessel's all right. I think it's Glenlange Archmage. This card's OP. That stands for overpowered, in case you guys... Yeah, because that song's 20 years old, and I've never heard... Like, I mean, I think I've heard that twice now, and I'm always like, wait, why does that mean? Uh... People were not using the phrase stand 10 years ago. They weren't using it three years ago. I guarantee you. Um. God, this pack's hard. It's Mirror Battle Sphere, Tezzeret. Could you take the Guardian? I think it's Mirror Battle Sphere. Could be Tezzeret. Yeah, Tezzeret's real good, too. All right, I'll take Tezzeret. You've convinced me. Oh, I like Underground Sea. I don't know if we're a Winter Orb deck. Felwar Stone could be an option. I mean, if we're playing Hostage Taker and maybe Grave Titan, we could just play Underground Sea. I don't see a problem with that.
Scarab God. I mean, let's be real, Scarab God is probably too strong not to take here. I don't think it's Greaves. Although Greaves is good. Darksteel Citadel also seems decent. Scarab God's just too good to pass, I'm sorry. Like, that's just not an option. Coalition Relic? Man, I stand Coalition Relic. Yeah, I'm just taking Coalition Relic. None of these other cards are even exciting. Morning rain clouds on my window. Lionside Diamond, Time Twister, and a Tendrils. Where where was this pack last draft? Agent of Treachery. Uh, I actually think Agent of Treachery is probably fantastic in our deck because we can make so much mana. Tezzeret Agent of Bolus, eh? Hmm. I guess I can put these over here. Lotus Petal over here. I think it's just Tezzeret, right? This pack is pretty unimpressive otherwise. Now I gotta go get five guys. Frick! But I'm going to get it delivered because I'm lazy shite. <laughs> oh, man. Value Bear, what's going on? Oh. Oh, Master of Ethereum? I'm game. I was going to take this Creeping Tar Pit because Creeping Tar Pit, but I feel like Master is more where we want to be. One, two, three, four, five. I feel like we're missing some artifacts. Put your pictures on my wall. It reminds me that it's not so bad. Um, Talrand, search for Escont is pretty good. I'm not a big Talrand fan. Talrand's fine, but. We need more artifacts. We only have five artifacts right now. Six if you can't steal Hellkite. Tyrant Scorn. Are we slowly morphing into a blue-black control deck? Eh, Frasca's Contempt is better than Tyrant Scorn, but... Supreme Will might be better than both. Felwar Stone came back? Oh yeah, we're doing it. I 
Yeah, Lotus Petal is just Mock Sapphire with uh, with Urza. <clears throat> oh wow, Dark Steel Citadel. Yes. All right. Wow, the Felwar Stone of the Dark Steel Citadel coming back is actually great. Teferi? Sure, I'll take a Teferi. Uh, you can have Dark Steel Citadel tap for blue if you have an Urza out. Eugene? Oh, Cryptic Command? Oh boy. You're speaking my language. Demonic Tutor too? Oh, I think it's just Demonic Tutor, right guys? I will pass a Cryptic Command for a Demonic Tutor. And I can't see at all. Not gonna lie, an ocean thief gives me chub in key. <laughs> well, I'm glad you don't lie about that. That'd be really awkward if you were like, I'm gonna lie to you real quick. This pack is stacked. We have Time Warp, a land that we could definitely use, Gaunti, Wretched Confluence, a Talisman. I bet one of these comes back. I mean, even Moment of Craving is decent. I kind of like Time Warp. Definitely not a four drop. I don't think it's Wretched Confluence. I think it's either between Time Warp and Drown Catacomb because I do want to, my lands. I just like with two Tezzerets, I like having Time Warp. I'm going to take the Time Warp. Ooh, two Gear Hulks? And nothing else, really? Torrential Gear Hulk can hit um, Supreme Will and Forbid. Noxious Gear Hulk is just a big fat killing machine. <sighs> Lodestone's alright. I don't think we're a Lodestone deck though. Like it's just it's gonna shut off most of our spells. We only have like one, two, three, four, five, six artifacts that we can cast. Seven. So I mean it shuts off sixty-six percent of our deck. By shut off, I mean it it, it neuters about sixty-six percent of our deck in terms of casting it. Yeah, I'm just gonna take Noxious Gear Hulk. We don't have a ton of removal. Uh, manifold key. Yeah, not only that, but like Noxious Gear Hulk, we don't like we could just kill a Sundering Titan, and gain like eleven life or something ridiculous. It's almost tempting to just take Mana War. I don't think it's Eldrazi Temple. I could see playing just Heart of Kieran. Turn 2 Heart into turn 3 Master of Ethereum is probably good. I mean, Master would be a 2-2 two, two, though, so it couldn't crew it just yet. Manifold Key is, Manifold key is all right. I mean, we just don't have a great way to take advantage of it. Outside of Coalition Relic, we're not really netting anything. Actually, Thirst for Knowledge. I don't know why I'm over overlooking Thirst for Knowledge in this deck. Palladium here? Icker Wellspring would be great. Do we have a way to get rid of it? I don't know. I actually like this pack a lot. Counter Squall's good. Serum Vision's good. Do we have a way to sacrifice an Icker Wellspring? I could have just made a 5-5. Five five. It just replaced itself. I think if that's the case, I like Palladium near better. Charcoal Diamond? 
An on-color diamond? I mean, we have Phantasmal Image and Thief of Sanity, too? Good lord. <sighs> so frustrating. All the good... Look at this. This pack is, like, it's like black card, blue card, blue card, blue card, black card, black card, blue card. Uh, we weren't playing Grave Titan because it was just double black, but, I mean, we also have Noxious Gear Hulk. At the time, it was a big deal, but now it's less so. I think it's Phantasmal Image. I'm just, like, wondering if we're even, like, an artifact deck at this point. Like, we just seem like a good blue-black control deck, but... I'm just going to take Charcoal Diamond. It feels better. Demir Signet feels good here. Bolus of Citadel feels all right. Meteor, Meteor Golem seems also very good. Undermine seems good. Like, the blue-black seems really open in this blue-black-red cube. <laughs> Like, I'm trying to stick with the Talarian Academy here and try to really maximize our... I'm going to take Golem here. Baleful Strix? Wow, that's all I could have asked for in this deck. I'll take Search for Esconta out. Eh, we're not a Mystic Forge deck as much as you guys are probably going to tell me we are. Drowned Catacomb came back. Yes. Spire coming back is actually great. Manifold Key is fine. Counter Squall? I actually want Counter Squall for the sideboard. We don't have a ton of... Uh, we have just, like, Forbid right now. And Supreme Will. And Glamour Arch. <laughs> okay, take it easy. 26 cards. Probably cutting one of these. I'm probably cutting Steel Hellkite. Steel Hellkite's less relevant because we're not playing... It's not Metalworker, it's Talarian Academy. So by the time we have six mana, we don't really need to... Apply, like, we don't need the extra one mana from the... Uh, from the Strix. Or from the Steel Hellkite. Okay, Thief of Sanity actually tabled. Well, that's insane. Undermine and Thief of Sanity tabled. I'm going to take the Chromatic Lantern out because we have Coalition Relic. Um, wow. Wow. That's insane. We need three cuts here still. I think we can cut one of these. Yeah, it's probably Chalice, even though I do like the potential to, uh... Actually, I like Chalice more than I like Felwar Stone. The upside of Chalice is just significantly better. I think we can take Forbid out for Undermine. I think the 3 life is more relevant than the buyback, but this is easier to cast. I mean, we're two colors. I think our mana base is actually very good. I don't think we care about Academy Ruins here, which is good. Oh, well, we're playing 16 in Lotus Petal. So, I don't know if I like this Tezzeret. We only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven artifacts early. Maybe Master can come out? We actually don't have a ton of artifacts, which is really interesting. When did we get this Notion Thief? Is that just like a random pickup? Four, five, six, seven, and then seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven.
So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven total in the deck. I gotta make one cut. Might be Supreme Will. Like we have Undermine. Could be Undermine. And then we have like, because we already have Glenelg and Archmage. Yeah, this is actually fine. All right, let me clip this deck so that I know what I'm able to do and get, especially with Demonic Tutor. All right, deck looks sweet. Fingers crossed. Thank you. Bill Brown with the resub. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. 42 months. God, how time flies. And we have a good top end. We have Grave Titan, Scarab God, Meteor Golem. I don't love this hand, but I'm real hard. It's real hard for us to mulligan this. Well, can't wait to play three Goblin Guide decks. Well, we've already played one. One down. We have a new spoiler from Eldraine. It shows the base mechanic for the set. Oh, who's who's we? As in, like, the... I mean, link it if you got it. Link it if you got it. Oh, boy. This is just a 2-1 with haste, right? All of us. We are. Spoilers are all of us. Yeah. I'm just going to Demonic Tutor for something that can help this. Uh, I don't know what it would be. Maybe Baleful Strix? Well, I mean, if you can link it, because I'm not going to, I can't, like, check right now. I know I'm not going to, like. But I'll definitely, I mean, we can, I, I'll pull it up if you can link it, and I can just click on it. Um. Frogler, good. Oh yeah, I saw that. We actually went over that. <laughs> we went over that guy. At 601, there should be a... Um, I feel like there should be another one. Because two hours ago, they had the 12. One hour ago, they had the 11. I imagine momentarily they're going to have a 10. Um, uh, I really don't know what to get here. It's just Coalition Relic, like we take a million, but then we get to, it's gotta be Baleful Strix. Yep, we saw Oko and we saw the other one. <laughs> you guys are just linking the same ones. It's my turn too, and I'm at 13 life already. Talk about feeling bad. Uh, Baleful Strix just seems better than Palladium Mirror. I thought I was useful. No, I mean, I appreciate good looking out. It's good looking out regardless. I mean, if they have a way to kill this, then it's two, three, four, five, six, seven. We go to six. Then we're basically just dead, right? Sulfuric Vortex. <laughs> oh, God.
Yep. Go to two. Yeah, I'm not even going to play this out. I do not think we have a deck for this. Riffling Cloudscape? That's a good dude. Oh, man. I got the seven drops. How to remember you like a child. Ooh, baby, baby, it's a wild aware. I'll play my turn one. Nothing on turn one? Jeez. Lotus Petal. Oh, God. Chandra. Slaughter. A land. What artifact can we get? We can get a coalition relic, but then we like we just lose Tezzera, right? in here maybe counter squall maybe hostage taker this is for you? yeah you can just leave it out there for now leave it out here? yeah right. i'm pretty sure the food kerwin ordered has been delivered oh my god i actually kind of like urza here and then we just take a turn off and then next turn we can urza one two three four five you know what's a shake is it a shake there's a shake there too. Oh yeah, give me that then, okay. for sure. Dang it, Kerwit. There's someone at the door. <laughs> oh man, one, two, three. So we're gonna have four this turn, right? We haven't played a land, four, five. So next turn we can play a six drop. I think we just get Noxious Gear Hulk. There you go. Wow. Kerwit, you are a f you are an un you are ridiculous, what else my dude. Clark Games, thank you so much for the raid, buddy. Really appreciate it. Get you impossible water. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. Because <laughs> he's absolutely ridiculous. How'd that happen? Uh, he was like, hey, you want a Whopper? And I'm like, I don't... And I think I'm good. And he's like, T you're getting a Whopper. And I was like, okay. Oh. Uh, that Sleep Machine Man is something else. Really? Yeah. What kind of shake we got here? This is like cookies and cream? With ch Oh. Well, that's something. Some of you want a red, man. Oh, wow. I was Actually, this was the other choice I was going to get. Chocolate Oreo. Chocolate Oreo is a hell of a combination, my dude. One, two, three, four, five, six... Kerwood, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate you. You are awesome. Oh, it's toughness, so I gained three from Carrie Zev.
Ooh, yeah, this game's over. So this is what I was talking about again. We're like the first game, it's a blowout. Second game, we work really hard, and I get I get get to win. Um, and that's presumptuous for me to say we won, but like I feel like I'm in good shape here. And then the third game, it's just like it's gonna be a blowout again. Hmm. Hmm. Are they killing this guy? Oh wow. There's a lot of a lot of resources there. How's your how's your machine? Uh a little overwhelming at first, but I think I got it. It's gonna go on your face. It is gonna go on my nose. It's gonna go up your nose? Yeah. Oh shit. Is it because your small mouth? I'm using it just goes whoop. I could use the full face mask one, but it's not necessary. How do you know it's not necessary? Because the doctor told me which one I could use. He said go with the nasal pillow one, which is the one that just goes up the nose. Yes, I got a CPAP. You got to fill it with water. What? Because it's got to humidify. This is the whole there's thing, like a whole, There's like a whole water container. I'll show you. It's crazy. Came with a nice carrying case, though, so that was good. Well, thank goodness for that. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Up your nose with a rubber hose, yeah. Welcome to the club. CPAP, boys. I didn't know sleep apnea was so common. It's super common. Especially for chunky fellows. <laughs> That's what big CPAP wants you to think. Stick to it, you will sleep better. Well, it also yeah. prevent me from dying in the middle of my sleep. So well, he good. can't sleep any worse, so let's... <laughs> See the guy that turns his sleep app mask into a face hugger from Alien? No, but that sounds grace awesome. Grace awesome. <laughs> that sounds grace awesome. Do, 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 do. Correct. Dying is bad. Wow. I'm going to nug this Chandra and get her out of here. Mikey B, will you be my CPAPy? Um, wow. Hmm, not so sure. Yeah. A Tesseract. I guess we can go find Master Ethereum. What do we got here? Coalition Relic Charcoal. Baleful Strix is also decent. Let's trade with the island. Actually, I like Baleful Strix better, I think. Master is going to be a 1, a 2-2. Two, two. That's pretty unimpressive. Baleful Strix it is. We can also potentially draw something. Like a Thirst for Knowledge. Oh, that was pretty good. All right. Now we can cast that. You can? Uh-huh. How? Shut up and take my money. Because Urza has text. Does he make your spell cost 2? My grandpa left me some money and he didn't know who you are, but he'd probably want you to have some of it. Oh my god, hold on, what did that say? Oh god, it's gone. Oh, you can tap the bail for Strix, I got you. There you go, you figured it out. Hold on, I have to open up Stream, Streamy Labs. Grim... Lava Mansario. You got it. Oh no. Oh no, I missed the donate. Oh, I can I can actually just never mind, I can just go to the I can just go to Streamlabs. Hold on one second, guys. Wow, experimental frenzy? That feels like a thing we gotta counter. problem is then we take four and we lose Tezzeret and I don't want to lose my Tezzeret 
I'm going to let it resolve. And I'm going to hope. Okay. My grand... <laughs> Oh god. Oh, so you can you could say a grandpa gave you this draft. Stiff in the chat. What did you say, nature's old treasure? Where are you at? Just quickly stopping by while I'm waiting on Okay, I got a stiff for you. Alright, hey, Nature's Little Treasure, can you do it for the um for the modern cube tomorrow? Because we're probably gonna get out of here after this. But modern cube starts tomorrow, so if you have them for, for the modern cube, that would be fantastic. Let me know if that's okay. I hope it's okay. <coughs> oh. oh. Hey. Oh. We're going to block. And then we're going to tap this dude. What happens if you mix some creative juice in your cr in your CPAC? Creative juice? Do I put apple juice in my humidifier? I don't know, man. That might be a bad idea. You're a bad idea. Oh, Scarab wow. God? Wait, to the slaughter? We have three card types in the graveyard? And this will be four? To the slaughter. Oh, that's insane. I don't even know what to the slaughter does. You'll never know. I'll never tell. Oh, wow. This is going to be bonkers. Are you ready for the, the crazy bananas? Just draw something good. Charcoal diamond is not great. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. Oh man, so we can do everything. One, two, three. They sacrifice a creature and a planeswalker oh. because we have delirium. So they get rid of Koth and Grimlavamancer. If only you can get rid of that shrine. Mm hmm. Yep, those are the two. All right, let's spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Dang. Juposhi, if there's a day that works better for you, let me know. Uh, you and Mike have to sing a little song for every card you pick. They can be the tune of already existing songs. But you should try to not repeat yourself over and over. Every song should be... Oh my god. That's ridiculous. You're absolutely ridiculous. A singing step, eh? Come on. Why are you like this? Good lord, my man. Oh, they just stoked the flames in our face. Now this is at eight. That should be double the cost. <laughs> yeah, you ain't kidding. Okay, well, this is just going to kill us. I, I, the, the number of times I've lost a fucking Shrine of Burning Rage in this cube is legit infuriating. Do you have any answers in your deck? No. Well, you just gotta deal 19 before it gets two more ticks. Well, they're getting one automatically, so if they play any spell... Right, so you gotta deal 19 basically right now. Hostage taker is an option. I guess we can hostage, we can hit, we can try to hit. It's your only shot. Come on, hostage taker. Is it for free? Yeah. That's, that's a good deal, I guess. We can try again with Tezzeret. We have to. Too bad Sorcerer's Spyglass is in our signboard. No, it's not. We just don't have it, I guess. <laughs> One time? Oh. One, two. Dang it. Buckle my shoe. Well, we had a good run. I gotta go and start buttering them pipes. Why are you? Why are you like this? Maybe you won't have any spells. Maybe, could be land land. He also can't play spells on his hand. 
it's not land land. Okay, that was land. You have to break the chain first. I know. What if there's another land on top? Oh my god. Are we living to fight another day? Got one more shot. This is a this is a mox. Yeah. Okay. Oh god. Not like this. Wait, can he just sag in response? Now we can. Before he couldn't. So yes, it's less exciting. <laughs> uh, okay, flame slash. Oh, we could have actually given him outs here. We could have actually given him a spell to play here. And Oh, that's true. Yeah, it's just terrible. One, two, three, four, five. What is it? Swamp. Sure. Untap two things. One, two, three, four, five. Cast for zero. One more shot. <laughs> All right, that'll do. We had a good run. I did not think we were going to win that game. And you didn't. Mm -hmm. Everything worked out. <laughs> hey, man, what are we? What's our plan after this, man? I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Man, 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 man. Are you okay? Man, 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 man. No. Mm -hmm. I'm not. I didn't think so. That's Felipe. He'll, he'll say chicken hearts. <laughs> That's probably what he's cooking tonight. I'm making some chicken hearts. Like on a, on a Barbie? Yeah, chicken hearts on the Barbie, even though we don't even have a grill. He could buy a grill top. He does. He won't. The, well, there's that one pan you have with the griddles. That pan you have with the griddles. I will play first. Okay. Oh, we're playing against old Johnny Cash out. It's like Johnny Cash, but he cashes out instead. Do you think they screwed up Oko's plus one? It doesn't say till end of turn. Create, why, wait. No. It's supposed to be... It's not supposed to be. It's, uh, it's supposed to be like a Pongify effect. Like Pongify or what's the other one? Um, monkey. Monkey is Pongify. We're rapid hybridization. Frogify. Yeah, frog, frog lizard. Oh, that was a that was a stellar draw. No, it's not Beast Within. Beast Within is any permanent. But I guess it's not Pongify either because that's just creature. So it's kind of in the middle of both. See this? <laughs> Wait, what did they do? They just strip mined a, a basic island, buddy. Actually, they basically strip mine themselves. It's probably thief sanity there. Yeah, the sooner the better with that guy, buddy. You ain't kidding. I ain't a kidding. One, two, three, four, five, six mana. What if we just Tezzeret and make this charcoal diamond a five five and just start bashing their face in? Does he make him a five five forever? Yeah. Did they send me the kit with the gingerbread minute? No, Wizards doesn't send me anything. Goblin Rune Blaster? Uh, we have no targets, so. Joke's on you, buddy. I got a bunch of basics. Hmm. Let's go black. 
One, two, three, four, five. We could play Gearhulk and just kill this, but that seems worse than just getting this guy down and bashing your face again. My Huckleberry friend. And I had Taco Bell and I'm now regretting it. Well, I would also regret that. Taco Bell's only good if you put fancy hot sauce on it. Even then, it's not that great. It's also only good if it's like past 11 p.m. and nothing else is open and you're like, oh, this is decent considering. Why is this all blurry? Eh. Edit this thing. Is the game waiting on me? No. Okay. Well, that's a that's a guy, all right. I'm gonna bounce my charcoal diamond, my sea coal dizzy. Hmm. Okay. That's a that's a deal. I gotta find a way to nug this Jace the Mind Sculptor. Nug is in your bug. I found a way to do it. You got Forceful? They conceded. <laughs> That'll do, pig. That'll do. Nug if you bug. That's what I always say. Counter spells seem good here. So does Undermine, so does Forbid. I'm just going to bring in all the counter spells. You weren't playing Undermine? Deck's too tight, man. Really? Mm. I don't know, man. Those are pretty good. What are you doing, man? <laughs> What? I'm stretching my eye out. Yeah. You never do that? I never do that. That's a fancy looking card, man. You're a fancy looking card. Dang. Also, I kind of like Notion Thief. Did you see him Over. try to... I don't know. Did you see him try to resolve that Ancestral Vision? And, and they playing, have Jace? Why are you playing Lotus Petal, man? Because they have Talarian Academy, Michael. Okay. Is that good enough for you? Yeah, I guess making it a mox is pretty good. Big plates. How do you spell Eldrain? It's got an E at the end? Sure. Okay. This hand is mono keepable. Mono keepable, huh? Char colon? What are you saying right now? Yeah, mo mo mono Where's keep your mox jet, man. Where's your mox jet? In the toilet. What does that mean? I wipe my ass with mox jets. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. You don't know me. I do. I got that Bitcoin stash. You don't. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know, man. I'm saving it. You're not. Never to spend. Till I die. Okay. Then you might as well not have it at all. That's correct, yeah. Remember this time that charcoal diamond just killed you? I can't remember that because that wasn't me playing the, uh, the game. Tell me more. I heard they took Garrick out of the Oubliette and put him in Eldraine. I'm, what? Is that true? My favorite Laporte of all Laporte. Don't tell my dad. I won't tell my dad.
Hey man, you still getting shocked by your keyboard? No, not since they fixed it. They fixed it? Nice. Not since the electrician came. Are we main phase topping? My favorite little pour is the dentist smile. <laughs> oh, Christopher. That's a solid meme. Cut. Yeah, so, Josh, I don't know if you heard, my entire computer was shocking me. Whenever I would touch any of the exposed metal, I would get a slight shock. Uh, my keyboard, the outside is metal. So whenever I touched that, it was shocking me. And it was all coming from the outlet, so... La 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 land, la 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 land, coalition rail against counter squall up, chocolate cake, go play talisman and kept up counter squall, that would have been good too. So I just had a conversation with a friend from the US and he said it's rude to undress your shoes when you're inside. I don't know if that's rude. I don't think that's rude. That, that dude's probably real uptight. Also, I've never had someone call it undressing your shoes. That's because he's not from the U.S. Yeah, that makes sense. You're so fucking judgmental. <laughs> Unless you mean your shoes have their own clothing and you're taking off their clothing. Really? Is this what you're going to do? Machi, machi. Your right shoulder looks like you're being Thanos snapped. Hmm? Right here. What are you doing? You giving a little wiggle? Yeah. You giving people what they want? <laughs> Is that what they want? Michael, who knows what they want? Well, they get a coalition relic, and that just makes me sad. I wish I had a better answer. <coughs> Every time I fin finish a milkshake, I feel terrible about myself. I'm like, what have I done? What hell hath I wrought? You could have counter squalled that, I guess. But I don't think this. No, it's pretty itself. common in the U.S. to take your shoes off. That's, that's what most people do. I don't know if you're when you're hanging out with your friends. I mean, like when you live at home, yeah. But I don't think when you go over to your friend's house, you're just taking your shoes off willy nilly. Do you work out? No. No, I, I don't. Hmm. I'll take two here. Ah, butter. I mean, I almost want to just meet your girl on this. It's just... I typically ask people they prefer me to take their... Would you like me to take your shoes off? Feels bad, but... Good lord. Working out does help with milkshake repentance. That's a good point. Such wise words. Such wise words. I have three counter spells in my hand and I keep tapping out for things. What a knuckle. What a knuckle? Mm hmm. Don't you mean knucklehead? No, just a knuckle. Huh. Hmm. Good talk, man. Was it? It was kind of shit. 
Wow. Break me That's off a are. piece of that Michael B's. What'd you say? That's what you are. What's what? Michael B? Kind of shit. Oh, well, you're totally shit, so I'll take being kind of shit if it means you're total shit. <laughs> Does it mean that? If you're absolute. No. If you're absolute. It means you're absolute garbage. You're an absolute trash baby. Yeah. Okay, so I'm proud of it. Tasha Taker and Jason, we've had. Uh, put it on the bottom, put it on the bottom, 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 bottom. I hate you. Oh, God, I hate you. See you later, cat. Well, see you later. Look at this. We got five damage in the hand. Cool. <laughs> you don't think that's cool? Should we forbid something and then discard these two in order to buy it back? Yeah, man. That's a good idea, right? It's a great idea. Nailed it. My dad once killed a cow by punching it in the side of the head. <laughs> huh. Alright, weird flex, but okay. Real Sky, have a good night, buddy. Break me off a piece of that, Michael B's. Are they just gonna keep they're gonna keep fate seal us? That's fine. Bottom, 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 bottom. Yes. Okay. Bottom means we get a new card. Even if they put a good card on the bottom, we still get a new card. Hey, look, it's a little man. Top means... Oh, my God. Look how close to you. What are you doing? I don't know. Top means that they don't they don't give a shit about it. It's not a threat to them, so it's really... If, if someone Jace the Mind Sculptors you and puts it on top, it's just the worst feeling ever. I feel like whenever when someone says you can keep it, it's just like, well, this game is over. Yeah, I'm like, all right, might as well, let's go to the next game, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, my friend. You can just, just, just peace out. Any chance you guys are going to Magic Fest Indie this weekend? Zero chance. I'll be there. <laughs> that was real matter of fact of you. I'll be there. I'll see you guys there. Alright. Come on. Oh, fuck. I just... This is so frustrating. I'm grateful for this Baleful Strix, uh, that it's... What other blessings are you grateful for? <laughs> what other blessings? Mm -hmm. I don't think Baleful Strix is a blessing, I'm just grateful for it. Uh-oh. What? I can't do anything, he's up on your table, man. Little man, what are you doing? Little man. Hey, get down. Come here. <sighs> yeah, I know, Tom. Oh, did you just ring? What animal could you beat without any weapons or help in melee combat? I don't I don't really think about animals in terms of what I can beat. Hey man, what animals can you beat up? I don't That's see That's my them. first question on the interview. I, <laughs> I don't see them as 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 challenges for me. Time for me to do some learning. Value Bear, have a good afternoon, buddy. I could beat up Frank. Wow. Chris is throwing on that hate have you ever seen chris before <laughs> <laughs> yeah but he could be real maybe he's real he's uh, not uh he's not. what's the word i'm looking for they scrappy one card in hand maybe he's scrappy you know scrappy huh yeah i mean i don't get that impression but he it could be possible a stiff wind would blow chris over wow 
the trash talking continues. And you just spit out, spit, you just spit out his drink. Drink is hard, man. Let's, uh, apparently. Let's not go. I'll give you a stiff. What? Uh, oh, that, that doesn't sound like fighting words at all. Anyone who thinks they could beat an ostrich is absolutely insane. Those animals are monstrous. Okay, well. Isn't there, like, some animal fact that an ostrich could kill a lion or something like that? I don't know. I think he just made that up. Hey, man, look at those. Look how straight those are. <laughs> those aren't my best work, man. <laughs> those aren't even straight, and they just, that's just how they look. I don't know what our opponent's doing right now. You just gotta tie the ostrich neck in a knot, then you win. Hmm. Solid strategy. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Come on. Can't be countered. Wow. <sighs> My brother was going to ride an ostrich, but he was too fat. <laughs> yeah, well, that's totally normal. Sorry, sir, you're too fat. Did they give us an emblem? Did they do anything? What's happening right now? Are they going to... What is... What's happening right now? I don't know what's going on. I'm really confused. Are they can like, negative one to kill my two guys? Sure. What? What? This is so weird. I mean, at least within a protected Jace. Oh, they just give me a card on top. That's cool. So now I get to draw land. How is that real? There's no way that's real. Hold on one second. I'm just gonna alt. I'm not gonna auto. Wait, why isn't it letting me auto yield to this? I don't understand. No human being has the ability to do that. I have no idea what this deck is. Sweltering Suns, Trinket Mage, Magus of the Will. Man, they're going all in on this the chase. Six stuff. They just keep putting shit on top. If this isn't a level land, I'm just conceding. What does that emblem do again? What? What does the emblem do again? What does the emblem do again? No. It does one damage to you. Okay. Yeah, it's also a plus two ability. That's good. It's not. I mean, it's good for them, not yeah, for us. All right. Let's go to the next game, buddy. We also have six minutes more than them, so... I was hoping to top deck, like, Tezzeret or something, so I could just be like, Nug your Jaces. I mean, we messed up in the very early beginning of that game by um, taking our shields down. I'm going to Gear Hulk and bring in Riffling Cloud Skate as a two-drop. I think I like that better. Oh, Michael Bees. Michael Bees. Living on the trees. He lives in the trees. 
He likes Chinese. What are you doing, man? You're pulling your shirt up? There you go. Thanks, man. Got you. I was also kind of scratching my back at the same time with the shirt. Wow, a skirt, a shirt back scratch. Yeah. That's next level. Yeah. I'm a pretty big good deal. Pretty big good deal. <laughs> I'm a pretty big good deal. Why do you guys catch what I say, man? Because I listen. Half listen? Because <laughs> can't you just half listen? If you half listen, I sound like a genius. Is that true? Yeah. Wow. Catch me outside, Michael. How about that? No. Michael? No. All right. This guy. Let's see what you got. Oh, I didn't even know they... God, I never know when they suspend these things. Do we get to connect with a thief? <clears throat> I'm here to connect with a thief. What'd you say to me? Didn't say anything. Yeah. That's what I thought. He thought wrong, Chase Mitch. the Mind Sculptor. Chase the Mind Sculptor. Dang it. Dang it. Dang Play his it. land. We can't do that. Why? Because you can only cast things. You can't play them. I cast lands all the time. What the hell's wrong with you? How else do you get them on the battlefield? You play them. They're two different terms. We oh, could also take Lotus them. Petal and then Time Warp. You never see that land counter spell? Jesus, shut up. Just shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Michael, just shut up. Uh, how much does it cost? Two? I think we're just taking Lotus Petal. Oh, my God. I really don't want to turn down my shields right now. You don't. I won't. I mean, we could have time warped, actually. That would have been dece. Dece nuts. <laughs> Amazing. Here it is. Oh, no, that guy's still getting countered. Goodbye. I'll see you later. I mean, that's basically just a baby Jace, right? Baby Jace. Doo -doo 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 -doo. God, Thief of Sanity gets two hits. Dark Ritual. What? So what do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana, eight mana. I don't really want to do anything. Neither are sweltering suns, though. I'll just take the ritual. That could be good later. Here's what we're going to do. No, Michael, no. Keep on crushing. Whew. Take it. Take it to the limit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, just to be clear, we can do this, right? Uh, one, two. Doesn't just pick one. God. Go. Oh.
All right, let's hope we don't die here. Michael B's on the highway. Show I am. me a sign. This is where they go. Jace, bounce this guy, attack Sarkon, kill it. That'd be pretty solid. Take Mike to the limit. One more time. What's your uh What's your favorite kind of biscuit? OP is so lucky to flip the Delver on the fourth try. My favorite biscuit? Yeah, man. Tell me about your favorite biscuit. Straight from the can, man. What's the can who's the can man? Nice uh you know, the little hoo hoo guy. The little hoo hoo guy? Yeah, the Pillsbury. The Pillsbury. I don't think I like Master. I think it's just worse than Undermine. Um, KFC has decent biscuits. You get them fresh. You think KFC has good biscuits? If you get them fresh. <laughs> They're not fresh now. Michael, I feel like you're being very fresh right now. Not a raw Pillsbury Discuit, man. You cook it first. What's a Pillsbury Discuit? <laughs> you never had a good Discuit before? A honey busket? <laughs> you know who doesn't have good biscuits? Who? Popeyes. Really? Yeah, they're kind of dry. That's the only thing they do bad, though. Everything else is fine. You gotta try that sandwich, man. It's sold out, though. We gotta wait. What are we waiting for? So they to get back in stock. Remember that time you called a biscuit a disket? Ideal. It wasn't too long ago. Ideal? Huh? Huh? You said it wasn't too long ago. What? What? Huh? What? Huh? What? 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 Mike, have you ever gone to the place in downtown Tampa and have your biscuit buttered? You gotta pay extra for the action, but it's worth it. <laughs> oh, wow. He's right. You do have to pay extra for it. Biscuits are the buttery, thick, soft breads things, right? Yes. yes. And they're flaky. A good biscuit is, anyway. I'm going to show you guys. I'll show you guys a biscuit. <laughs> I'm going to look up biscuit. Oh, look at those. Look at those buttery boys. <laughs> Get a good picture, man. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good looking one. Oh, no. Just, just show me the image. I don't care about your page. I'm sorry. Look at this beauty. Open up. Look at that flaky bastard. Zoom in on that guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Look at those nooks and crannies. That's going to absorb all the butter. You know what place is made in Biscuit Red Lobster? Yeah, the cheddar biscuits are pretty good. I haven't been there any just... I mean, let's be real. That's the only reason to go to Red Lobster. Just like the breadsticks that's because and the you don't, salad. That's because you don't like seafood, though. Even if I did, I'm not sure Red Lobster is where I'd go. Yeah, it's not super great. You're not super great. Wow. Got him! I just pictured Mike going in the kitchen and said, Man, I want a tisket. And he pulls out the can and slams it on the counter and just pours it into his mouth. <laughs> wow. And everybody's like, What's a tisket? But in England, biscuit somehow means cookie. Yeah, that's true. Give me a tube drop. Oh, that's actually pretty juicy. I'm not sure if showing your biscuit is allowed on Twitch while. Wow. It is. What are you unzipping, man? Is there a zipper? Michael's got zipper pockets? What a friggin' maniac. Keep changing there. So I don't fall out. What kind of change? Quarters. Nickels. Dimes. No pennies, though. <laughs> the, I don't even know why pennies are still in production. They really should discontinue them. They're pretty useless. They should discontinue you, then. Wow. God, I gotta go home now. You live here. Dang it. <laughs> well, go to my area of the home. Where's that? The go, corner look, store. Go to the corners. You got a store in the house? Yeah. Does Mike have the pants that unzip at the knees? Those are the best. I used to have a pair of those. They're also trip pants. They're super goth. Trip pants? You don't remember trip pants? No, dude. I worked at Hot Topic and I don't remember. What are, I probably know. They what sold them me. at Hot Topic. Yeah, I probably know. They'd always, they're, they're like black and they have like chains on them and stuff. Oh, like red Jesus, zippers. Those things. Like, yeah. It looked like they had suspenders on them. Yeah, pretty much. I used to own a pair. Because I was a cool kid, you know. Let's slow down. Um, 
kind of just want to Noxious Gear Hulk this PN Kieran Millar. I'm still surprised Americans even use hard money anymore. You love the plastic so much. I mean, I don't really carry around cash usually. I don't carry around cash usually. I'm a credit card man. Or like a debit card man. I'm a debit card man. I ain't got no credit cards. I got like four well, credit well, cards. I have, that well, I, I do have a credit card. Time. I just can't use it. Wow, because the government? Yeah, no, because I government didn't pay took it. my money. <laughs> Well, no, because I, I haven't paid in several months. Oh, so that's probably good for your credit, actually. <laughs> Buddy, my credit's so bad, it doesn't even matter. I mean, it does if you start fixing it. Did you ever think about that? No. Okay. It's never occurred to me. How come you just haven't paid your credit card bill? Don't worry about it. What? Okay. It seems like you can just pay it, right? I haven't paid it in so long, though. So what? What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, like, well, if I haven't paid in a long time, I guess I'll never pay it. I don't understand what that means. Like, go on. That's really all there is. So wait, but you didn't answer my question. There's not a good reason. Why haven't you paid it? Like, why don't you just start paying it? I don't know. Oh boy. <laughs> Jesus God. Should have brought it up. My bad. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> I guess it's your bad. I need glue first. Fix Have you considered credit. making a payment right now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. He's right. How can I pay the credit card bill if I don't have money on the credit card? It's like Tesseret, not Time Warp. That's really fascinating. Oh, wow. That's a good draw. That's a real holy smokes draw if I ever saw one. Guys, donate some money for Mike's credit card debt. Please don't. He's not going to spend it on the bill. He's just going to spend it on fucking donuts at the Wawa. <laughs> I'd lie. I'd say I was lying. Or, no, that sentence says I'd say I was lying. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm lying. I said it. Pay um, that bill. Pay that bill. I'm trying to get a chant going. Show me Mac B. Michael to the B. One more time. I'm oh, sorry, what? Michael to the B. Hey, man, you want to get some pierogies? I don't ever want a pierogi. Really? Why would I want that? Because they're delicious. No. It's just a it's just a dumpling filled with potatoes. You're a dumpling filled with potatoes. <laughs> wow. That's literally what you are. Is it some sort of rat credit card? Probably. <laughs> Don't you hit on pierogi, see? People love the pierogies. Name one person who likes a pierogi. I think they're okay. Name name one other than yourself. Mazonster. He didn't say he did like. He didn't say he liked him. He just said not to hate on him. That implies he likes it them. It doesn't imply that. It implies he dislikes you hating on them. No, I don't know, man. See, look, Hodge Gloss. He loves him. Damn it. Wow, finale of eternity is pretty good. See, I love pierogies. You're rude, Frank. Got him. Alistair Kane mm -hmm. likes them. See, look, mm -hmm. so many people like pierogies. They're delicious dumpling that you dip in sour cream. <laughs> Can I link a picture of milk? Or Mike. Oh. Wow, you even know how to spell your own name? No, you read it as milk for some reason. <laughs> it just wow. looked like milk to me. Can I link a picture of milk? Why would he want to link milk? Michael, that's your name. Oh, that's me! <laughs> like, oh, Michael. Oh. Michael, don't do anything stupid. You getting that fat boy? No, it's just a, on my, it's just a post. Why would I get that? Why not? Oh, good. You don't like a fat boy? <sighs> cool, old man, huh? Well, see you later. 
Yeah, post the link. Yeah, Coalition Relic. Amazing. I should just be playing the Counter Souls main deck. <laughs> oh my god. What is this? Is that a picture of me? Yep, I'm done here. I always have Mike with my cereal. Wow. Oh, that would have been actually decent. Shit. Now I feel terrible. Oh, God. Oh, God. I have the regrets. I should have just drawn Scarab God. Gotten back Agent of Treachery. Stolen their Ugin. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. I has a sad Oh, now. Lord. I just got a little tilted there, guys. I'm going to be honest with you. Got a little tilted at the, the progression of that match, so... It was fair to assume your deck would disappoint you. In a way, it still did. Yeah, I mean, they cruel ultimated him to me. Like, I was just like, okay, you just, like, drew six cards. I lost my two cards. I lost five. You gained five. It was very demoralizing. But goddamn, Scarab God's a hell of a magic card. It's pretty good. Hey man, are you okay? You're just staring into the abyss right now. I was thinking. Oh, here we go. Love struck beast. What were you thinking about? Swimming pools? My dad. Okay, so this is a three mana five five. It can't attack unless you control a one one creature. That's actually pretty sweet because it's like a oh that's actually fantastic. That's really good though. And then you can play it as a sorcery for one green, create a one one human creature token. That's um, that's amazing. This card is great. It's a good design. Domino's and Dairy Pizza. What the fuck? Is this just a Domino's pizza covered in jalapenos? That seems insane. That is a lot of jalapenos. That I might say it's too much. Yeah, saying never concede unless you're done on board is a lot easier said than done. Obviously, that's the correct choice. That's 100% of the time that is what you should do. However, it's a lot harder in practice. I think this is only for Japan. Well, what gave it away? The yen? Yeah. That was what gave it away. Yes. That is what gave it away. I will keep. I will send back Golem. You talk about that all the time. <laughs> Would you like me to talk like this all of the time? Probably for a little while, and then I'd be like, kind of over it, you know? Okay, I will talk like this for the rest of our friendship. Wow. Would you like that? You're not my friend. That is too bad. I still consider you a friend. <laughs> now, now I feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> I understand my friendship is not for everyone, but it is for you. Wait, so it's literally just Beauty and the Beast? Yeah, pretty much. That's yeah, that's the cool. whole point. Pretty sure you, I mean, you just ask for... You can make that pizza by just simply... Being like, hey, I want a pizza with lots of jalapenos. When I say lots, I mean like all of your jalapenos in the building. <laughs> I'm going to go in there and check that out. I don't understand. Are you being serious right now? No. You're not being serious. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a car hood for something. No, man, this is a this is around yeah, there. Yeah, I get it. I get it now. It's real cringy. It's pretty bad. Why is that a thing? I don't know, man. Is it a real thing that people can buy? Yes. Wow. <laughs> Woo!
Remember that song from New Vegas? No. That what you don't remember that Whistling song? No. Are you being serious? Yes. I never know when you're being serious because you're <laughs> you make no sense. I actually I actually don't know what you're talking about. Well, that's the impression I'm getting. Yeah. I never listen to the radio as much as you do. That's so weird because the music is unbelievably good. It's like the reason to play the well, game. Well, I like the now. mood. The actual background music is good too. Did you comment cringe face on that? Uh, I said holy shit. Yeah, like it's just unbelievably cringy. That's the impression that I get. <laughs> If I ever had close to tragedy, you'd be close to those who have. No! Never had to knock on wood, but I know someone who had. This is an obnoxious play. Oh, wow, they didn't actually just kill this? Flat out? That's cool. Never had to Michael B. But I know that Michael B. did. And that's Michael B. Well, Karanos is really hard to deal with in this cube. In general, it's pretty hard to deal with. Yeah, he's a real... Real scumbag. Who has enchant removal, right? And the lightning bolt, of course, with cruel ultimatum. Sounds amazing. It's just a spell that says 50% of the time you draw a lightning bolt, 50% of the time you draw an extra card. And cast Kinda that nuts. lightning bolt for free. And then, you know, sometimes you can actually attack with them as well. Sometimes. But I'm sure it isn't good. Arguel's blood fast. I'm not gonna argue with that. <laughs> yuck, yuck, yuck. That's right. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Can you imagine if we Thief of Sanity didn't hit their crawls, man? That'd be pretty good. That would've been the most gas shit ever. <laughs> the most gas shit ever. You heard me land I just want lands at this point oh that's a land holy magolies yeah that's a land that's four mana yeah <laughs> that one was not intentional <laughs> no. that one was not intentional one two three four five six seven eight nine cause I'm sure it is and good that's the mug bee that I get. So actually, we have to win two, three, four, five. We can't actually play Noxious Gear Hulk and keep up Counterspell here. One. Why not? Because there's four mana in this, and we need six mana for this. So we can do. Oh, you don't have double blue. Gotcha. We have double black, but we don't have double blue, which is really frustrating because. <sighs> There's no reason to really cast any Gear Hulk here. Except for the fact that I want to win the game before Karanos takes over and draws them infinite cards. I guess that's true. Oh, okay, good. I'm glad you <laughs> I'm glad you think so. Alright, well we're just passing here. With double counter spell up. Jace, and now he's lighting gold member flying cloud skate, and now all my threats are going away. Paranos, more like pain in my ass, Anos. Pain in your ass and nose? Yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> Anyone black or blue mana would be helpful. You okay, man? You're doing a lot of shifting over there. I'm just shifting, man. Don't worry about it. Time keeps on shifting, shifting, shifting. That's not how the song goes. Into right? the. Bober. Into the bober. I'm gonna fly like a bober. 
let my spirit carry me. I think Mike and Frank would be good players for a D and D game. That would require friends. <laughs> that would require us to be friends. Mike would just say nonsense the whole time. You don't know that. And you'd be like, man, can you be serious? I'd for take a mine very seriously, okay? You take mine very seriously? Is that what you said? I would take mine. You're what? Myself. I would take mine very seriously? What is that? I played D and D once, okay? Did you? Yeah. One sesh. How'd it go? It's pretty good. Did you lose? Well, we did you lose? No, we didn't win either, though. Then you it lost. never really ended. So if you don't win, we never finished it. You lose. We never finished the process. You lost the game. No, we never finished the game. You didn't win it. <sighs> so you lost it. Wow. What happened to all your friends in the game? They were fine. They died. <laughs> That's the Michael B that I get. There's no music right now, man. You're just kind of... You just look like you're having a weird stroke. Is it a weird stroke? Or is it just a normal, regular stroke? D &D. What was your D&D &D character? Uh, we were playing like a one of those D&Ds where it's like modern times. So I made a I made a hitman character. God, Chris, you really do get songs stuck in my head like constantly. It's it's actually ridiculous, dude. Okay, so that's gone. That's gone. We know cruel. Mm, that's the impression that Mike gets. A doot doot. Hey, I'm singing here, buddy. I'm singing too. You can't stop me. God, but if I could. Can we just kill them here? One, two. So if we go like this, we get Tezzeret. We still have mana for Undermine. Tezzeret turns this into a thing. And then we just have 11 damage. Are we just killing them with this? Have you ever felt close to tragedy? I've been close to Mike who has. This is an indestructible 5-5. Five, five. Oh, something's happening. Oh, we're just going to draw a card. Buddy, you have a death wish. Oh, we just won the game. Caranos. Yeah, cheese hands. Of course, cheese hands. <laughs> is this cheese hands? Yeah, it's cheese hands. I tune in every day just to see what Frank's going to sing to me. <laughs> I'm never disappointed. What are you doing, man? You picking the cheese out of your ears? Yeah. You getting that ear cheese? Yeah, man. That of your cheese, that of your cheddar. That's something, man. Ear keeps on cheddar, cheddar, cheddar. Into my biscuits. <laughs> oh, Lord. I'm gonna fly like a biscuit. To the sea. That's right. Fly right into the future. I think we're good like this. I might actually want Jace Beller in here. Over like Thirst. Yeah, I like that better. I still don't know what animal Frank could beat. <laughs> Me neither. Probably not a bear. You don't know me. I do. Please. Real question time. Best way to enjoy a breakfast biscuit, bacon, egg, and cheesed or gravied? Well, God, they always ask me the meat questions and I don't eat meat. What about minus the bacon? But then egg got, and cheese. Yeah, I love a good egg and cheese 
biscuit, actually. Do we keep this hand? I like a gravy biscuit. I'm going to keep this times. hand because we have Counter Squall and we have Coalition Relic. And they mulled the five. Oh, man. Biscuits and gravy are freaking delicious. You know what else is delicious? My dad. Your dad is delicious. No, it doesn't even make any sense. God. I can eat some. I'll, I'll eat the shit out of some egg and cheese croissant, which is, though, from the BK. Hey, you're like BK's number one fanboy. That's because they got the bacon, egg, and cheese. The, the, not the bacon. Shit. The egg and cheese croissant, and they have the Impossible Whopper. It's true. I eat some meat. I eat, like, turkey and chicken sometimes. But I try to minimize the amount of meat I eat. Your Impossible Whopper's getting cold, man. What are you going to do? I don't know. Heat it up. In the microwave? Yeah, why not? What about on the stove? Give it a nice fry. How about fish? No, no fish. It's got ingredients on it. It's got like pickles and... What are you doing? You wouldn't like to get a nice press on the on the flip-flop? No, because then I get... How, it's got a bun. Right, yeah. You toast the bun in the pan. What am I doing with all the ingredients? The lettuce, the tomato, the pickles, the they onions, on the, there. the condiments. Like They don't move. I just put the whole the whole burger on the like fully complete on the griddle. Yeah. Toast one side, flip it over, toast the other. But you're toasting the outside of the bun. That's not how buns work. Why not? Because you don't toast that. That's just not you how. You don't it... know me. I'll toast everything. Oh Jesus, Michael. <laughs> okay, now we have spells for days. So I'm actually not gonna make the same mistake we made last game, and try to ramp our mana. Why minimize meat? It's so good. Because uh, I like animals more than I like the taste of meat. You gotta eat the lettuce. Brain maggot? This is not worth forbidding, but they just take the forbid if we don't kill it, so... That is true about fast food places. Like, you can go to some fast food places and you're like, oh, that's pretty good. And then you go to another one and you're like, well, this is the worst experience I've ever had. You gotta eat the lettuce. <laughs> is that from something? Yeah. Is it a game from something? Yeah, it is. Jesus. All right. Well, now we'll relic because we only have one thing we can play here. Basically, if I ever make a reference and you don't know it, you can just assume it's game grumps. You're just making a bad penny. Yeah, you're just like treating a bun like an like a reverse bun. I don't think he's serious about that, but he just went on about it for a long time. And I was like, <laughs> I feel like you're really... I've never done that, to be fair. I've like never really, actually done that. You're really committing to this method of cooking right now. What if you took the whole burger and put it in a panini press? I'd be more on board with that because it seems more evenly distributed. And also, I don't have to flip it. Flipping it feels really messy. But I'll be real with you. I can probably just put it in the microwave for 30 seconds, and I think it'll be fine. Yeah, but then you get that... The mail might be too hot, you know? Oh my god, I'm getting real tired of this nonsense. Gonna fly like a beagle. A beagle? His name is Schmeagle. You have a flying beagle that's name is Schmeagle. I didn't want to brag about it, but... <laughs> One, two, three. They have five lands. Okay, that's good for us. Oh, God, yes. Kill it. Kill it. Fly right into the future. So, like, if if they don't do... If they just dirtle around this turn, we get to go Time Warp, Attack for a Million, Tezzeret. That's fine. They're going to just exile this guy. Yeah, that's fine. Oh boy, my name is Biscuit Bob. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Dang, it's so close. Let's go to black here. That still leaves us with one, two, three, four. Make a land. No, I just, 
Uh, I want to keep up Notion Thief so in case they activate this, but I don't think I really care, right? I think we just want Tezzeret to make a thing. Yeah, that seems good. Oh, they can transform it now. Oh, and they get to add a black. Oh god, they're gonna go red, cruel tomato must. It's gonna be brutal. So what's a pizza that Mike would never even touch? Like what's a pizza like what would be a pizza from your nightmares? Uh anchovies are pretty disgusting on pizza. Hello there. The pizza from my nightmares. <laughs> They're going to go red mana, cruel ultimatum, and then I'm going to wish I had notion thief mana up. Damn. This is indestructible, my dude. <laughs> I think they just realized they're like, oh, wait. Oh, man. Dark still Citadel Tezzeret. C -c -c combination move. That's, what's, that's a pro gamer move. They made the pizza from Ninja Turtles once. The anchovies and marshmallows wasn't that bad, actually. Ugh. Guys, go to patreon.com slash franklapore and donate $1 to $2 a month if you want to support the channel on Twitch or on YouTube. And uh, it's a great way to support the channel if you don't have the $5 a month for Twitch or if you don't have a Twitch account. So patreon.com slash franklapore. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on manatraders.com. You can find the link and promo code in the description for 20% off the first three months. And CoolStuffInc.com, you can use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. And I have new articles up going up every Wednesday. I love you guys. I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons.